Mike Rice faced reporters just after he was fired today. I will, at some time, maybe I'll try to explain it, but right now the, there's, there's, there's no explanation for, for what's on those films because there is no excuse for it. I was wrong. Captured on those films were practices where Coach Rice repeatedly threw a basketball at players, striking at least one in the head. Off camera, Rice can be heard shouting using gay slurs. The basketball practices were videotaped between 2010 and 2012 and were reviewed in November by Rice's boss, athletic director Tim Pernetti. Pernetti reported the incidents to the university's president, Robert Barchi. In December, Rice was suspended for three games, was penalized $75,000, and was ordered to undergo anger management counseling. The videos aired for the first time on ESPN yesterday. I'm Seth Doan, we're with CBS News. We made repeated requests for an interview with the school. They declined. But in a statement, Pernetti explained why he hadn't fired Rice immediately. I am responsible for the decision to attempt a rehabilitation of Coach Rice, he said. Dismissal and corrective action were debated in December, and I thought it was in the best interest of everyone to rehabilitate. But I was wrong. The athletic director said as recently as yesterday that Coach Rice would keep his job. Scott, it's not clear if anyone else at the university will face disciplinary action. Seth, thank you.